when I use the word Christar, by the way, or any of the words like Christ, spell it with a K, it's either K-R-I-S-T, sometimes we use shorthand, or K-R-Y-S-T, it's spelled with a K because that's how the original one was, and the first seven audible sound tones of creation, and they are Karaya, uh, Sata, Ha, La. It has to do with the sound tones, the vibrations, the first audible sound tones when we get into first part of creation. Before all these structures occur in the cosmos, there are certain things that happen on a very, very, very nano micro level that uh, the first, what would be audible sounds or audible vibrations. The stories of the Christ and the Antichrist, the Christ and the Antichrist, were all about a knowledge we once had on this planet that was clear, it was technical, it was this knowledge that told you about the physics mechanics of creation and of biology in manifestation. Everything starts out Christian. There is nothing that was created as anti-Christic. And it anti-Christic doesn't mean evil bad necessarily. It can act that way sometimes. But what is evil but live or live spelled backwards? Christian is a form of light that allows for perpetual motion creation because it can continually re-spark itself. So anything it expends, it can actually replace and replicate. Natural light, Christic light, breathes, expands and contracts. We were, once upon a time, a species that was immortal. Our bodies did not die. Death is not a natural condition for the human body form. However, we've been dying for a very long time on this planet. There's a reason why we've been dying on this planet, and that reason is a genetic mutation. It's a genetic mutation that has been rendered on the deepest core template level of the subtle bodies, the Catholic grid. And because of that, literally, the way our chromosome structures evolve, the way our gene code in chemical terms evolves, it is not functioning on its original divine blueprint. You have a history, a long history, of exploring some very, very hard subject matters involving polarity and densities. So you can be proud of yourself for getting as far as you have. And you can also realize that you have absolute power right now, right here, because you've got this far, to make absolutely Christed choices and to become a Christed being with regardless of what your matrix wants to do.